In this video, you will learn how to multiply by multiples of 10. The first thing you want to look for is the basic fact. So that would be one digit numbers without the zeros. So for the first one, we have seven times 30. So we will be looking at seven times three. So first we will do our multiplication of seven times three. Seven times three, that fact gives you 21. And then all you have to do is add the zero. So since there is one zero in this problem, we'll add one zero on. So seven times 30 would be 210. Let's continue working with multiples of 10. So we're going to look for our basic fact, which in this one will be three times six. So three times six gives us 18. And then we're gonna go ahead and add the one zero to make it 180. Three times 60 equals 180. Let's do the next one, 90 times eight. We'll look for that basic fact, nine times eight without the zeros gives us 72. And then we'll go ahead and add the zero to make it 720. 90 times eight equals 720. Let's do two more multiples of 10. So we're looking for our basic fact. We have five times 20. Our basic fact will be five times two and five times two gives us 10. And then we're going to add one more zero to make it 100. So five times 20 equals 100. Don't get tricked with that extra zero. One of the zeros is from five times two is 10 and the extra zero is from the 20. Let's try one more. So we have 60 times nine, the basic fact, six times nine is 54. And then we'll go ahead and add that one zero to make it 540. 60 times nine equals 540. Thank you for watching my video. I hope it helped. Check out my teaching exchange classroom for worksheets and centers. View my grade three multiplication bundle for practice with these strategies.